How's it going, YouTube? It's RJ here. Um, currently I am driving home. Just spent my day off with my girlfriend, and I actually just really wanted to film. Uh, today is now February 20th, at least in my time zone. But, um, yeah, the YouTube partnership program is going to end for me. I've been checking up on my watch time, and I'm not going to be anywhere close to the 2,420, yeah, 240,000 minutes that I need. I'm at 140,000 minutes, so uh, I'm not going to get 65 days within the next hour unless, what is it, 65 times 24. Uh, it's gonna be impossible for me to get there but that's not gonna stop me from uploading shouldn't stop anyone from uploading all the smaller youtubers it might discourage a few and I get that and it might discourage a lot of the people who just reached a thousand or who just got their first paycheck from YouTube um, I don't want it to discourage you guys but um, everything's gonna be all right I gotta tell myself that often. Uh, surprisingly, I actually tell myself that a lot more than what a lot of other people do, I guess. I don't know. I'm not the only person in the world. Uh, of course, if you guys have been with me since, what was it, two years ago now? Uh, I sometimes relapse into depression and suicidal thoughts but I don't ever act on the thoughts in my head I'm just like huh what if I died today and the thing is a lot of that also comes from the fact that I joke around about it a lot um me and my friends we just <laughs> we're probably not the best people as in like when it comes to our jokes we're pretty bad with them actually uh we have dark humor and we we're always telling each other how we want to be dead inside and it's we're all dead inside but the thing is it's all gonna be all right so every other youtuber who is getting hit with this demonetization slash losing chances to put thumbnails on videos it's gonna suck for a little but as long as you keep at it you started from nothing and then you got to where you are you just got to keep working at it I've been doing this for five six years got my first paycheck in December and I'm on my way to working towards being able to get another paycheck in this year I should actually be able to do it but I gotta get that watch time up there um, I have a few videos that I actually did plan, but I had to scrap a few. I actually filmed completely an entire Pokemon Go parody. The audio cut off of the clips that I used, which absolutely sucks. I, all the audio died. And the thing is, I wasn't very comfortable with how the video was laid out didn't think any of the joke oh I didn't think a lot of the jokes hit I had a great time filming it It was probably one of the most times I had most fun times I had filming up until I fell on my ass and scraped it up and it's kind of it's healing now well it's been it's been healing for a little bit I scabbed the crap out of my ass and it was funny I wish I had that on film but no so just be careful when you're playing Pokemon Go around the mud kids but yeah, there was a few videos I wanted I uh, scrapped just like that because I just wasn't okay with it. I want to produce better content for you guys than that, and I know I could. Um, but I'm not gonna stop uploading. Um, I'm gonna try to do a few more Pokemon things. I've been letting my Pokemon side of my YouTube ch channel die down a little because honestly, Pokemon, I love it to death, and my channel will always be based around Pokemon from the beginning 
my whole start came from Pokemon, but originally I just wanted to do skits and parodies. I thought that would be fun because I plan to write, film, act, direct. That's the type of stuff I'm into, and doing it on YouTube is probably the best way to go about it. Um, don't let any of that ever hold you guys down. But work and school, they're going to completely distract from doing Pokemon-related stuff. Now, the reason why I can't stop from Funko-related stuff is because the way that my schedule works, I can always go hunting on Thursday. I always have my pops around me whenever I'm at my dad's house, which is, um, what is that? Thursdays through sa Saturdays? Yeah, Thursdays through Saturdays. I always have my pops there. I can always do a review. I can always showcase what I'm getting. Because me and my dad, we always get new things. There's always going to be something new with that. Pokemon related, however. Uh, I can get new shinies, but that's about it. I can do new battles, make new Pokemon, but after a while, it gets a little tedious, which sucks, but it's just a grind. And when I tried doing the YouTube daily grind, uh, that was completely difficult. I had to stop that. It, was, it sucked. I had to figure out what I was going to upload every day. And I had like a little thing set. But I couldn't follow through with it. School and work came in the way. And they come first. Because YouTube's just a hobby. And that's all I want it to be. And that's why I'm not worried about losing the monetization. I'm more, I'm more worried about losing the idea of uploading longer videos. Uh, the thumbnails, yes, it does matter to me certain videos I love making thumbnails for other videos I just choose from the three screenshots from my videos they give to me but yeah this is I don't even know what to call this video it's just talking on my car ride home um all that is all good and everything um I'm happy right now uh, other things I want to talk about yeah, I'm scared, actually. Uh, I usually get scared with um, communicating with other YouTubers, per se. Now, um, it's not the hardest thing. I actually think that everyone that I do communicate with off of YouTube, it's, um, I don't know if I can keep it friendly or if I can keep it business or keep it whatever it is because I don't understand um, any, I don't really have boundaries I actually try to do everything more of a friendship type of way it's not ever a business for me I always wanted to I always want to do collabs and everything I have a few friends that I've done collabs with already and I would like to do more with but they don't upload as much anymore and then um other youtubers that I talk to they're bigger than me uh significantly bigger than me and I get scared whenever I talk to them because I'm like, oh, this would be cool. I'm bouncing. I, I, I want to bounce an idea or I tell them what I plan to do. And then I'm like, oh, snap. I hope they don't feel like I'm using them. Or like if I say, hey, do you want to do a collab video? I don't want it, them to think that I'm asking to promote my channel because even though I know it does help out my channel a lot, it's not what my intentions were. My intentions were just to film a video and do it with people that I consider, you know, I don't know, friends slash acquaintances. I'm, I'm pretty cool with a lot of the people I talk to. I just get scared, which I don't know if anybody else ever feels that way. Um, just that if they're talking to a YouTuber of a bigger size that they think they're cool with, but they get scared like I do where... <laughs> I'm like, oh, uh, maybe I shouldn't have told that person any of my ideas or, like, bounce anything off of them because what if, what if they're like, why are you doing this? You want, all you want is free promotion. And I get scared of that shit. I don't know. Like I said, this video is probably going to just be random talk up until I get to my house, but I don't know. It's, I just miss talking to you guys, actually. Uh... I'm literally just stuck at work all the time. And I don't get to talk to you guys without talking about Funko Pops and YouTube. But Funko, though, let me tell you, that new It Wave, that is 
going to be possibly like the thing I want the most. And I can't wait to get it. And I'm gonna get some of the plushies too because God dang they look beautiful. And then with Pokemon, I actually want to do some, I actually want to save up a bit of money to get me a booster box. And then um, a friend of mine a booster box. And then potentially do a little collab like that. But it's more like I'll upload it no matter what. They don't have to upload theirs. But I know they love Pokemon. And she's a really good friend of mine. And I've been saving a up a little bit of money there. But yeah, I honestly don't know what else have to talk about this was kind of just a random video and I just wanted to talk about like certain things talk about YouTube being kind of crappy at the moment but it's gonna get better talk about that I'm okay uh, mentally I know like it's been two years so half of you newer subscribers the majority of the newer viewers I have that came from Funko they don't even know um in short, two years ago, two and a half, uh, what is two, a little over two years ago, I attempted suicide, um, and then I had relapses where that happens, I had bipolar issues, which, which sucks, but I deal with it. I got really good friends, and they helped me out through everything. I love my friends, and I love you guys. I'm serious about that. I wanted to actually do this live, but I realized, you know, driving and doing it live probably isn't the best thing. Hell, even driving and doing this in general isn't the best thing, but since I have the brightness on my phone all the way down, and I don't even care if my video's even in the face, you guys can just listen to the audio. And I'm just focusing, I'm putting, I have both hands on the wheel, I mean, I have one hand holding the phone, but both hands are on the wheel. And, driving is my full attention, but I'm going to be safe. I'm literally like 25 seconds from being home, 30 seconds, 40 seconds, something like that. Maybe a minute or a half, minute and a half, two minutes. But yeah, I just wanted to say thank you guys for being there. Um, definitely be on the lookout for more videos. I have to wait for my tax returns to get back, but there's a um, Stranger Things door shelf that I really want to work on. I just haven't had money at the times where I'm filming just because where I want to do it just because I got other things I need to buy. And I'm also looking for that stupid glow-in-the-dark Black Panther and a stupid Eric Killmonger because I need them. And then they released two more of the same exact pop but in different colors and of course I want both of them because one's when he's in the spiritual world, the other one is where, well he's in the spiritual Black Panther world and the other one is where He's in the regular world. Uh, what are those? Those sandals. I love the movie, by the way. Black Panther was amazing. But Oh, Bunny, please. Go. Oh, my gosh. Bunny. Bunny. Bunny, please stop. Um, all right. Well, uh, that's it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, just stay tuned for more videos. Don't even smash that like button. Uh, see you guys soon. Relatively soon. But until then, YouTube, goodbye.